lovely Pisces, welcome to my channel. My name is Katie. I am here with your daily Pisces reading for September 12th. This is the September edition of the daily Pisces. Know that there will be a few months in which I can, you know, organize myself in order to provide you with a daily Pisces. It's not something I can do permanently because it's just too much. <laughs> Sorry guys, daily readings forever. It's just too much of a commitment to make for me. But these monthly infusions of daily Pisces, I don't know, I like the idea. So universe, let's see, what is the most important message that you have for our lovely Pisces collective, sun, moon, rising, Jupiter or Venus, placement in Pisces, um, for today, September 12th, or whenever they run into this video. Know that you can watch this video any day, at any time, and the message will apply for you, okay? So let's see, universe, what is today's message? Okay, we got the electric eel spirit. Bring your ideas to life. Card number 24. I'm gonna be reading the message directly, directly from the booklet, as you know I always do if you follow the daily Pisces. Let's see what this message brings for us this morning. Seemingly out of nowhere, the jolt of electric eel spirit appears to awaken you to a big idea that you're meant to explore. Epiphanies and aha moments are gifted to you right now, so celebrate. Your life has the potential for profound transformation. Inspiration arises in you, electrifying you so that you can't wait to get started bringing your idea to life. The revelations you experience now are meant to set you on a new path, so do not be afraid to act. Explore, examine, and do not fear the changes that may come. For spirit wants to shower you with love, success, abundance, and more abundance that you hope to experience. Hmm. Now is the thrilling time of epiphanies, inspired ideas, and innovation. This is a wondrous sign for you today. The protection message is... Ideas need to percolate, as they rarely download in detail form. Have you too quickly dismissed an epiphany because you couldn't see where it might lead you? Have you rushed to follow the muse without taking time to contemplate the meaning of your aha moment? Perhaps your dream will take a different form that you first imagined, morphing into something else that is even better. Spirit's plans are often hard to discern, but so much more satisfying once they have taken over from your own predetermination. Maybe your big idea is taking more time to shape than expected. Have you considered that you're meant to learn something in the, in the process of bringing it into being? Commit to the transformation and to learning any lessons in this new venture. And soon you will, you will see that your ha was even more val valuable than you realized when you first felt it electrify you. Oh my god, I love this. This is so inspiring. This is, this is fantastic. And... You know, something that I've, I realize about this particular energy is that sometimes we don't know that that's what's happening. Sometimes we just feel this irresistible urge to do something and we might not even think about it or where it could possibly lead. It's just like this impulse. And from that impulse, a world can be created. And that's what I find so beautiful because the universe kind of like places that impulse, that electrifying impulse through our intuition in such a way that our brain doesn't, you know, necessarily know what's going on. It's just something that happens, divinely guided. And I feel like that's what's taking place here. So please let me know in the comment section below how this applies for you. And especially if you've had any aha moments recently, because that's really powerful. Guys, I love you. I love you so much. Thank you so much for being here with me today, for hanging out, for reading this, you know, beautiful message with me. And I'll see you tomorrow morning, <laughs> as I always do this month. Please make sure to check the description box below for the links of the Patreon and the merch. I've got a lot of really cool hoodies and mugs and t-shirts, and I'm in love with them. And I am like my best customer right now, <laughs> which is kind of lame, but I'm in love with the merch. I'm in love. It's so fun to design as well. So please make sure to stop by and just let me know what you think and see if anything resonates with you. And I'll see you tomorrow morning, guys. I love you. Bye.